Hello everyone, my name is Christian Negulescu. Welcome to another episode of Learn New Epic in 5 Minutes. Today we'll talk about how to work with PDF where you need to use OCR. So what's the idea? You have some PDFs that are imaged, so you are not able to select data from, from that PDF. And in this case, you need to use OCR system to extract data. So inside of your iPad Studio, you have here uh, multiple types of OCR. If I, go, if I go here and write OCR, you will see that we'll have Google Tesseract, OCR, we have Google Tesla, like Microsoft, uh, Microsoft, and also we have our UAPAD system for OCR. So the idea is like this. Uh, I have this PDF and I want to extract data and I need this OCR system. So let's see what are the different. So inside of UAPAD Studio, you have to install the uh, first the PDF activities. So you have to go here on all packages and select PDF activities. This one, you have to install it. After you install the PDF activities, uh, we need to see, so to work with OCR, the data is um, read um, PDF with OCR, and here you have to put inside the, the OCR system. Now, we need to make an analyze between the, the OCR system to understand how we approach this stuff. So I have this one, and to show you some something live, I will use the screen scraping, and on the screen scraping, I will use the OCR system. So here, uh, the, the, the full text or the native is not working, and when I go to say with uh, OCR, you will see that he's able to extract the data uh, with OCR and you will see the format of the data. Now, I already did this, uh, this stuff. And I will show you exactly uh, how is the response. So take a look here. This is the res response with um, Microsoft OCR. I will, um, I will show you here the, all the response. So I have the response. This is the response with Microsoft OCR. If you remember our movies with, um, uh, with PDFs, uh, I have here different explication how to extract data from uh, from the PDF with um, um, with a lot of um, uh, logic on vb.net and so on and so on. So watch these movies. But here with OCR, the idea is that you add another layer of uncertainty because um, here is the data with um, Microsoft PDF, uh, Microsoft OCR on this format. If you extract with Google, you will have this format. And you see on case of this PDF, you have some um, some mistakes, yeah. And if you use the if you if you use the UiPath uh, document understanding uh, UiPath OCR, uh, you will use this data. You see, it's better, but this data it's on the raw. So to be able to use this one, you will use uh, you will use it like this. So read the PDF with OCR. You put the UiPath uh, document OCR. Here you have to put the endpoint and the API key. The endpoint will come from here. So if you take a look um, uh, here on the on this public endpoint, you will see that for Europe, in our case, um, you need to use this one, the uh, UiPath OCR, yeah. And to be able to get your key, you have to go to your orchestrator, you have to go to admin, you have to go to license, you have to go to robots and service, and here you'll get your license for document understanding. Okay, so now the idea is um, uh, you have to test the document with all the OCRs, and after you test with all OCRs, you will decide with what OCR you will proceed, yeah? And you will build the logic based on your OCR. Now, if you want a dynamic, uh, uh, a dynamic decision of the OCR, I mean, um, let's say that you put a robot to test with multiple OCR and you, you want the robot to decide, uh, in this case, you have to implement something like this. You'll do a, a for each on the, um, all the strings and you'll count the numbers that are not uh, numeric that are, so you, you check here if it's, it's a, if it's a number, if it's a numeric stuff, it's a light letter, or if it's a space and something, yeah? So to be able to, uh, to make a rule to avoid, to see, how, uh, to see how many unknown characters you have uh, in your uh, stuff, yeah? So this is to make a dynamic, uh, dynamic uh, comparison between OCR. So that's the idea with, uh, um, with OCR. Use the uh, read PDF with OCR and then select here the type of OCR and make a fine tuning and see what is the best for your OCR. As usual, if you like my movies, please subscribe to my channel here on the YouTube and comment to my movies and tell me what else you want to see inside of my movies. Thank you very much for watching. Have a good one. Stay safe. Bye bye.